we can take it as read and written that a future of literary thinking exists out there for the imagining or making. Just as the future of literary thinking is tied to the future of democracy, so it is tied to the deconstruction of religious systems, mystical and supernatural thought, anthropocentrism in general. Future literary thinking will certainly need to engage, not unlike the blog critics, with the pressing concerns of a wider world. What we write will no longer be dictated by the implicit or explicit identity politics which currently drives the academy. In the age of the internet, the profession needs to go on the attack and take literature seriously, wresting it back from people who do not read that well. The future of perhaps too readily implies that there is a present, a fixed and reassuring now of the literary. Nothing is less certain, as the future as such is just a scratch, <laughs> unravelling in plaster, a spine of pure cord. Everywhere I look in the field of humanist studies, I see scholars who have moved beyond the polemics and dogmatism of the 70s and 80s, and incorporated what we've learned from the culture wars into their work in a wholly positive way. Of course, there are still some who are intent on fighting old wars, as there are some who seem never to have been touched by them. But I do think there's a new spirit abroad, and it's one that gives me every reason to hope.